you and I'm confused when I say who I'm related to. I know. <laughs> you're my brother's boyfriend, I always say. <laughs> you're, my, you're my brother's girlfriend. I'm your brother's girlfriend. Yeah. Maybe <laughs> 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 a boob, something said. <laughs> Good morning. My vlogging camera died. Of course it did. It's such a it's a really good camera, but the battery sucks. Anyways, it's Wednesday. I've absolutely sucked vlogging, but today I'm gonna take you with me th through the entire day. We will be starting with getting ready and then we will head over to Agnes because I need to shoot a collaboration and in the morning our apartment super dark and then i have a meeting with um a girl who will hopefully help me decorate the new office and then i need to get some work done i've had meetings back to back monday and tuesday so i haven't had time to like go through my emails and like organize everything like all of the admin work so i need to do that today and then i have what do i have after that then i have a visit to the new office then i go back to our current office work some more and then I have a meeting with Adam, um, our newest employee. We hired him, so he's based in the US, super exciting. I'll tell you guys more about that. And then after that, I have an interview with the magazine. And then after that, I have a styling session with Majuri. So it's a busy day, tends to coffee. I drink coffee every morning, but yeah, I need to get to it. I need to clean my face. First, I need to give Ross his coffee. That's what I do every day. No, lie. He made the coffee yesterday. Okay. Oh, it's so messy here. Mm. Right, Real? It's so messy here. Anyways, going to get dressed. I just did my hair. I will film tomorrow. I was in a rush, but I will film tomorrow when I do my hair again. It's literally just the Dyson Airwrap, though. That saved me today, but... Meeting is um, how much can we tell? I know you put 
posting is. Like this weekend? You decide. <laughs> wow, YouTube makes Agnes nervous. No, so we're working on a really exciting project. We're upcycling our pants. Mm -hmm. So our pants will, the, well like the claim, like the, what's it called? The yeah. faulty pants. Yeah, when we get claims. Yeah. So we want to do something with those. Exactly. We don't want to just, you know, have them lying somewhere. So we're upcycling them with a studio from my hometown, Bros. And it's going to be, it's really exciting. Mm -hmm. It's going to be really nice. You guys, you're going to love it. And it's going to be very, very, it's a very exclusive and limited drop. Yeah. So they're going to turn it into something completely else. New. A whole new product. But we can't very tell exciting. you what the new product is going to be. We have to keep that a secret. But we're jumping into the meeting now. Oh, hey, uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all I can tell you. But it's fun. It's another way to like close the, close the loop, close the cycle of a product. And we never want a product like life to just end. Mm -hmm. yeah. We always want to create new ways, think of new ways to, you know, Keep our products alive and this is one way that we are really excited about we've been working on this for quite a while now mm. and hopefully we will be able to launch it beginning of next year january which feels like a really long time but like when you think about it it's just yeah, like three months just a production it's very yeah. short time <laughs> it is but the thing that takes the longest for this project is like the time to like source all of the other stuff i don't I, i'm gonna give it away <laughs> I can't, I can't talk about this because I'm accidentally going to tell you guys what we're doing. But anyways, when the first sample is set, like when we have approved the first sample, it only takes like three to four weeks in production. Mm. I wonder how many girls they are. I wonder how many. Yeah. I need to tell you guys. I think it's a pretty small team mm. of them who sits and sews everything. And we're going to record and document the whole process so we can yes. share more when it's exactly starting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and it will not come out of the way. Also, when coming soon, it will not come out of the way. Yeah. So it is Friday now and we are going work well we're not doing anything right now but we're gonna go through a few like fabric swatches see if there's anything we like we are currently working on next year's items of course oh <laughs> your bun <laughs> it looks so huge in the background this <laughs> is uh, but yeah, we're working on new things and we're trying to always find, you know, like the best fabrics for everything. So this is usually what it looks like. You just get a, we get a big little, what's this called? Pile. Pile <laughs> of fabrics. And then we go through them, kind of like narrow it down. What do we like? What don't we like? And then we kind of take it from there. Coolers by Nooners. Can I like film this so they can see a little bit just to give them a little sneak a peek so what are we thinking here, Agnes? Go Barrow. Hmm. I thought it was cute. Tencel. Mm -hmm. Our blue mini skirt was Tencel. Mm -hmm. You know, way back. Not well, way back, it was last year. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like a long time ago. It does. Is this like pants or shirt? Sure. Or? I thought it was really nice. What? Took away my photo. That was so good. This one? Yeah. Oh my god, wow. So soft. Wait, what do we do with this? Anything. So, just to explain a little. Usually, I like come up with an idea. Like, I know what I want. Like, okay, let's say that I want a pair of pants. No, that's too easy. Let's say 
I want a pair, like, I want a skirt or something. And I usually come up with, like, the fit and everything, and then we kind of choose fabric. That's usually, like, the way we do it. But then sometimes when we have fabric, we also, like, so let's say we really like this. Then we'll be like, okay, what can we create with this? Or any of the upcoming styles? Would any of the upcoming styles fit with this material? So there's, like, different ways of designing, and we kind of have, like, different paths on how we do it. Um, but, yeah, this is definitely something that could be, like, we find a material and we didn't have anything planned that we think would suit this material but then we kind of like start thinking and then you come up with something but yeah that's how it usually goes so we are also working on a new color for our tank top and we have lab dips but we're not happy with them so we're trying to find um the perfect beige color oh yeah i said it we're very... in beige very difficult. It is very difficult. And I feel like it looks dark on the Pantone, but then when you get it lab dipped, it's so light. Mm. So like it's hard to understand how dark we need to go on the chart. Oh, we definitely need to go darker. Summer sand. Which one is summer sand? Can you find it here? No. It'll be fun to see like what it looks like on the Pantone. Oh, was it that light? Yeah. I don't think there's any beige. Banana crepe. I love the names. It's so much fun. Let's see. Palace blue. Sand dollar. Delicate <laughs> blue. Putty. Putty. Butter Putty. cream. You can't. You can't find it. No. Okay. Well, we gotta keep on looking. Okay. Just so you understand. So this is what the color looks like in the Pantone color, and this is what it looks like in a lab dip. So this is on organic cotton. So you can kind of tell that it's a little difficult, you know. Hi. Oh, that's annoying. Hi. I'm in my PJs. I don't know if you guys can tell. Boxers in a size large, so they're huge. And then a Realization Park t-shirt. And my MEJ scrunchie. And I'm doing some laundry, and then I'm going to watch the new season of Grey's Anatomy. Not the new season. I mean, it's the new season, but the newest episode. I'm so excited. It's the best. I feel like, okay, so I really just need to get into this, but I feel like as I'm cooking up laundry, but I feel like this, this is weird. This new season, is it like season 18? Yeah, I think so. I just feel like it's, it kind of feels like the old Grey's Anatomy. And if you've watched all of the season and you've also watched the newest episodes, let me know if you agree, but I kind of feel like, I mean, the corona, the pandemic season sucked, unpopular opinion. I mean, the beach scenes were nice, especially, you know, the first ones with you-know-who, but the rest was just a little boring, if you ask me. I mean, Meredith, seriously, is the main character, the reason why I'm watching, and she was just not present. I just feel like this season, it feels more like before, which I love, and I love Nick. The new doctor. Or, you know, not the new. The old new. You know. Yeah. That's that's it. I'm excited. Me and Rufus are going to cuddle. And maybe I should put a new... Yeah. Before I hang the laundry, you're going to be scared of me. But, okay, let's do it. Anyways, it's been a long week. Or, you know what? It hasn't been a long week. This week has just flown by. But it's been a really intense week. Like, we've had back-to-back -back meetings every day. It's been, you know, like, it's been wild, but a good wild, but also like a draining wild. Like, I feel so socially drained. I haven't met this many people since before Corona. Like, we haven't had, you know, like face-to-face -face meetings. Everything has been on like Skype or Teams. So I feel like now that I've met people in real life, I realize how much I've missed it. But I've also realized how socially draining it is. <laughs> Well, I'm definitely one of those people, you know, that needs, I need to recharge. I need alone time to recharge and to just be. So that's what I'm going to do. But other than that, life is fun. Tomorrow, oh shit. Tomorrow it's going to be nice and sunny. I think I'm going to enjoy the weather, I guess. I don't know. I'm just excited. 
that excited that it's the weekend. Weirdest vlog ever. I feel like it's so hard choosing what to drink. But not what to eat, but not what to drink. I guess the one that I want. So Bianca's making us caprinas. Mm -hmm. Did I say that right? Caprinas. Caprinas. Delish. Delish. Yeah. I'm excited. Woo! Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, well, sugar crew. Let's see. <laughs> What glass do I get? No glass. No. Yeah, but I want you to take this one. Thank you, buddy. Let me try first. Agnes, huh? Agnes, you do? Big even. A face of desperation. <laughs> Agnes, you need to come more in there. Random. The trash cans are there. Yeah, it looks random, but these are sleeves for our tube dresses. Mm -hmm. Another an idea. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Another way to wear our tube dress when it's chillier outside. <laughs> or you just want to look a little fancy. Yeah. You're going to put this on and you're going to be ready for fucking anything. Red carpet. Yes. Yeah. I'll show you. Perfect. We do a pass yog. <laughs> Mm. You feel cute? Very. <laughs> and we still have our silicone tape, so it's gonna stay up mm -hmm. when you're raving. No matter what you do when you party. <laughs> do you want to try the dress on as well? You know, just so we can get like an idea. Recording. How glamorous are you? Got a full glam squad. I'll do your hair. I'll do your makeup. Yes. <laughs> you don't need any of it though. Natural Brazilian beauty. Okay, well cute. Do you feel good? I feel very cute. Do the arms feel good? I would make them a little bit tighter. Yeah, okay. I think well. you need to size down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can we try an XL on her? So we released <laughs> so, I'll stand here. I feel like the light is better. So we released the tube dress back in some this summer. And it's been like one of our best sellers. We love it. It's the perfect piece. Like it's so versatile. You can wear it going out or just chilling. And then now that it's colder, we really wanted to bring it back. I can take one. Um, but we wanted to make like a little addition just so if it is chilly where you live, you can still wear it. And that's how kind of like the sleeves came about. <laughs> For us, sustainability is such a huge aspect when designing. And instead of just creating a brand new dress, we were like, okay, but what is the most sustainable way? That would be to just make sleeves you can put on and off. Mm -hmm. So you don't need to buy something new. Like gives such a dress. different look, I think. It's yeah. like a completely different thing. Yeah. Okay, cute. So cute. Ooh, so good. Yeah, very nice ready. and very comfortable. Good. Okay, well, thanks, babe. Thank you. Ida. Yay. Your turn. Okay, cute. So nice. Very nice. I love that look. Yeah, yeah. the sleeves are gonna have so many. Yeah, you're gonna purposes. be able to wear so many yeah. different ones. Yeah. Also, if it gets just a little bit chilly, you know, put them on your t shirt. Long. And our new denim. I'm obsessed. Okay. And it feels good? Yeah, it's really nice. It's cozy. And you tried your size. I guess you're one in the video. Scooch in. Yes, I tried my size, but this top was not very good to try them on with. But then we've tried XXL, XL, medium, extra small. And I know that small will fit me, so. It's perfect. Good job, everyone. Okay, now we need to get ready for the fittings. Yes. We're gonna have fittings today because we have a shoot on Monday. I'm so excited. We had a problem about the shoot though that I need to. Damage control. <laughs> Thank you.
So we are currently having fittings. We have a shoot on. Do I have like a smooth skin filter on? How do I get rid of this? I don't know, okay, whatever. Um, so yeah, we have a shoot on Monday. So now we're doing fittings for the shoot. So a few girls will be coming today and then a few tomorrow just to, you know, like map down their sizes. Um, Rufus, what are you doing? Rufus? Oh, yeah, and this is Ida. Hello. So yeah, it's fun. It's a very busy week. It's been a busy few weeks. But we're excited. We're shooting new items, so we're dropping new things in two weeks. And we're shooting... On Monday. On Monday. And we're very excited. Yeah, we are. It's going to be so good. And we have so many fun drops in November. So these are things for next year. So we can't show you anything. Okay, where do we start? And just hear my reaction. <laughs> oh, there must have been another. No, sorry. There was. I was like, there's nothing here. <laughs> but there were. Oh, actually, something. Oh shit. They show lots Material, Agnes. Oh, oh shit! Wow. Oh my god, made on this It's amazing. Wow. Oh my god. This I want to wear. I literally want to wear right now. I wish the sample color was cuter. Mm. I hate navy. Yeah. <laughs> what? Some. Oh, that would Cute. That's gonna be so comfortable. We're gonna have to slut it up. <laughs> Okay, what you guys can see is our. I wanted to wear it with like high boots and a warm sweater. So cute, fun yeah. queen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we're launching the Musta mini skirt in black. I cannot believe we haven't launched it. I know, I can't believe now. it's taken us this long. It's, yeah. it's like to realize. Yeah, it's crazy. You guys have been asking for it. Mm. Um, I'm wearing the staple sweatshirt in a size extra, extra large. It's a little. <laughs> it's extra large. It's very big. Um, but yeah. So this is coming so beginning of November. We're really excited. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna have to. <laughs> it's like this. Mm. 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 I'm gonna have to say goodbye because I need to walk through and I need to feel this. Exciting!
Je vais Allô Oui, je vais 